Minute from St. Michael's Orthodox Church in Geneva, New York. I'm Steve Toby. Today's Gospel lesson is from St. John, chapter 10, verses 9 through 16. Before we read today's Gospel, let's pray for understanding with Father Gregory. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Illumine our hearts, O Master, who lovest mankind with the pure light of thy divine knowledge. Open the eyes of our mind to the understanding of thy gospel teachings. Implant also in us the fear of thy blessed commandments, that trampling down all carnal desires, we may enter upon a spiritual manner of living, both thinking and doing such things as are well-pleasing unto thee. For thou art the illumination of our souls and bodies, O Christ our God, and unto thee we ascribe glory, together with thy Father who is from everlasting, that in all holy good and life-creating spirit, both now and ever to ages of ages. Amen. And now today's Gospel according to St. John. I am the door. If anyone enters by me, he will be saved, and will go in and out and find pasture. The thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy. I came that they may have life and have it abundantly. I am the Good Shepherd. The Good Shepherd lays down his life for the sheep. He who is a hireling and not a shepherd whose own sheep are not, sees the wolf coming and leaves the sheep and flees, and the wolf snatches them and scatters them. He flees because he is a hireling and cares nothing for the sheep. I am the good shepherd. I know my own, and my own know me. As the Father knows me, and I know the Father, I lay down my life for the sheep. And I have other sheep that are not of this fold. I must bring them also and they will heed my voice. So there shall be one flock and one shepherd. The Word of God. Yesterday we read and talked about the narrow door that leads into the kingdom of God. Today our Lord tells us He is the door. If we want to enter the kingdom of God, it is through the door of our Lord's teaching and example. That's a pretty simple lesson. Well, have a good day, everybody, and I'll see you again tomorrow. And may God bless us all. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Oh, give thanks unto the Lord.